so typically, like if I've got one that's, that's not wanting to be as broke, whenever I get across that cow, I'll just want to make them wait and let that cow, you know, really pull them somewhere. Seems like if you let that cow uh, pull those horses, you know, it, it tends to open them up behind, uh, which when they spread their hind feet, it allows them to turn around softer. And, and usually you can, I want them to get to that stop, wait, draw, and then try to let that cow pull them through the turn. John Burgess, he told me one time, he said, you go to stop, you stop to draw, and you draw to turn. And I think about him telling me that often because I feel like I'm constantly focusing on the inside rib of this horse and their inside shoulder. When they land, I want them to load up and I want to feel all that soften in here and come back to me. Um, once they hit that ground and, and soften in here, uh, once the inside of this horse softens, what the, that, the first thing that does is